You see, a lot of people right now that's talking about this situation are not adding the proper context. Because in my personal opinion, the two reasons why this situation took place between Draymond Green and Rudy Gobert is this. Number one, Anthony Edwards and Draymond Green had got into it the night before. You remember that? The game before when AE went off, he was cooking them, talking noise at the free throw line like, hey, man, why you found me like that? And Draymond was like, hey, what you going to do about it? You ain't going to do nothing. And AE was like, hey, man, ain't nobody worried about you, bro. You trying to be tough out here. You ain't no tough guy. So Draymond was ticked off from that situation that happened previous night, right? So he went into that game with the whole mindset of saying, if anything jump off, I'm going to be the first one in the mix to prove a point. And then the second point, in my personal opinion, is this. He knows deep down in his heart of hearts that eventually, at some point in the postseason, they are going to have to see the Minnesota Timberwolves because they are legit, ladies and gentlemen. If you follow basketball and if you know that Draymond Green is a four-time NBA champion, Draymond Green has pretty much seen it all and done it all at this point in his career, right? And I know that whenever he thinks about the younger teams that's going to come up, you got to look at the Minnesota Timberwolves, man, because they got any and everything to pose a threat to anybody out west. I mean, hell, right now, I believe they would 10 and 2. 10 and 3 or something like that. I can't remember. But the point is this. That was a psychological move because he knows whenever he gets tough in the playoffs, he can punk them. He want to punk them. So he sent the message going after the biggest guy on their team, knowing that don't nobody really fuck with Rudy Gobert in the NBA. Yeah, I said it. And he took that as an opportunity to flex his muscle in the show. Y'all look, whenever we see y'all further down the line, oh, we going to have the physical advantage and a mental advantage. Yeah, I said it.